Welcome to our GLSL shader tutorial. Today, we're tackling a question that many graphics developers encounter. Our viewer is looking for a way to create a bordered rounded rectangle in GLSL. They've successfully implemented a filled rectangle using a specific function, but now they want to add a border instead. Let's dive into the details and see how we can help. Welcome to another tech video. Today we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution for you. Guys, remember to stay a little bit crazy, like me, and hopefully get to that resolution. Now, let's continue on to that video. To create a bordered rounded rectangle in GLSL, we need to modify the existing function for a filled rectangle. Let's start by understanding the original function. This function calculates the distance from a point to the edge of a rounded rectangle. To create a border, we need to adjust the logic to define an outer and inner shape. Here's how we can implement the bordered rounded rectangle. We will create two distance functions, one for the outer shape and one for the inner shape. In this function, border defines the thickness of the border. The max function ensures that we only get the border area, while the inner shape is subtracted to create the hollow effect. Finally, you can use this function in your shader to render a bordered, rounded rectangle. Adjust the parameters to fit your design needs. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To create a bordered rounded rectangle in GLSL, you can use sign distance functions. The simplest method is to subtract a smaller rounded box from a larger one. Here's a code snippet for the unsigned rounded box function which calculates the distance based on position and size. To subtract one shape from another, use the operation function that takes two distances and returns the maximum. Finally, to get the border of the rounded box, subtract a smaller rounded box using the border factor which should be between zero and one. Check out this shader toy example for a visual demonstration of the bordered rounded rectangle. Let's now look at another user suggested answer. To create a bordered rounded rectangle in GLSL, avoid using a secondary box for extrusion as it reduces performance. Instead, compute a single object using signed distance functions or SDFs. These functions allow you to add multiple shapes without significant performance costs. For the rounded box, subtract a term from the distance. To create a border, use the absolute value of the distance. This will remove the inside of the shape, leaving an empty border. You can increase the border size by subtracting another term. This technique works for any shape as long as the distance estimation is accurate. 
SDFs are versatile for various visual tricks. And that's it guys. We've gone through, I hope you found your resolution and found the answer you're looking for. If it helped, please hit subscribe, really appreciate it. And be on the lookout for more technical help videos. Have a good one. Thank <laughs> you.